Hey everyone, I'm Ricky, and today I'm going to be watching Money Heist Part 1, Episode 13, the finale, and I'm so excited for this finale. I can't wait. There's still like four more seasons after this, but this is something that I've been waiting a long time for. I just can't wait. <coughs> Last time on Money Heist, a bunch of hostages got out. There was a shootout. Oslo, I think, got killed. I'm pretty sure he's dead. Helsinki looked like he was probably gonna just start, like, massacring people, which is probably not good, or trying to. I don't know. Who knows? Tokyo had a good plan of bringing that little machine gun out and, like, shooting at them so that they could put this wall up, drill it back in, or whatever they did to it. The professor got Raquel off of his trail. However, he was missing in action when all of this was going down, so he couldn't really tell them what to do, but it did get Raquel off his case. On top of that, the other guy that was spying on the professor basically is, like, about to die, maybe, possibly. I don't care. I don't really like him. He was, he's, he's too much of a nuisance. He's, like, in the way. So, I mean, it's kind of convenient. It's sad, you know, his story or whatever, but, like, just in the, in this specific instance, I'm like, yeah, whatever. Arturo's the one that started everything because he's annoying, and then he pussed out and told Denver what was going on because Denver was about to beat him up because Arturo tried to kill him. It's crazy. It, this show is so crazy, and I cannot wait to watch this, so I'm just gonna watch it right now. Let's go. Damn, he looks fucked. Oh, he's still alive. Okay, 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 okay. Kill him! Kill Arturo! Yes! <laughs> Kill him! Kill him! <laughs> no, okay, so wait, he is dead actually. Yeah, no, he's dead. Professor fucked up. I mean, granted, he had to get Raquel off his case. Like, he was, how is he supposed to know that Raquel thought he was gonna be, you know, the person? I don't know. He kind of fucked up on that stuff. He's usually, like, really good about, like, keeping things in check and, and knowing what to do and everything, but that, I don't think he expected someone to die out of his crew, so... We'll see what happens. I didn't think they were gonna tell them that. I thought they were just gonna keep it a secret. Because <coughs> then now that kind of gives them hope. They're gonna fuck with them now! <laughs> yep, of course, fucking Marina, or what's her name in this? Allison Parker is gonna join in. Tokyo, just shoot uh, shoot them or something. Shoot up at the... Shoot Arturo! Kill him! <laughs> Kill him, please. Yeah. She's a bad bitch! Oh my god! Oh, death stare. You don't want that. Good. Yeah, like, she's intimidating. The other guy's not. Are we serious right now? Yep, that's what I, that's what I just said. Damn, they're giving him all the information. Fuck. <sighs> Damn, I was hoping that they would just... She would just presume he was a traitor. Oh, the messages! I forgot about that. Don't answer them, don't answer them, don't answer them, don't answer them. No! Oh my god. Please have the voice mailbox full. Yes! Yes! <laughs> and this old bit bitch isn't gonna think of texting her, probably. Ugh. Gross. I like that they're planning their life together. Why are 
That's so cute! Oh, this is such a weird situation, but I like it a lot. <laughs> they are so cute. There's nothing bad better ever happened to them, otherwise I'll be pissed off. <laughs> oh, good! Okay, good, 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 good. Oh my gosh. <sighs> yes, I love that she's telling him directly. He better figure something out. He's gonna have to, like, kidnap the mother or something. Because, like, Raquel's eventually gonna have to go there and. Uh, I don't know. Is he actually gonna have to. Kill, uh, I don't think he would do that. He wanted to do this without doing any of that. Oh, man. He's gonna find some other way, I'm sure. Oh my god, what is he gonna do? Oh my god. Oh, okay, he's alive. Oh my gosh. I'm going back and forth. I don't know if this dude's alive or dead. Okay, he's alive. Yeah, if they, if they take Oslo, then they could potentially get information about all the other people. That's, that's, that's not smart. Ah! Oh, Nairobi! Oh my god! Ah, <sighs> man. Good. I'm glad Helsinki stepped in. Oh my god! This is so... Oh, oh the silence. I hate this. Oh, this is so awkward. Is he gonna... what is he gonna do? I don't know. Oh my god. Poisoner? Yeah. You better hurry up and put it in there before she turns around. Dump it in! Go! Oh my gosh. Stop being so weird, dude! Oh my god! Oh god. Don't stop her, just just let it happen. Just let it happen. You're gonna be fucked otherwise, stop. He... See, now you're gonna have to just... Oh my... D don't even... Are you serious? Did she really just forget that that happened? Is it possibly maybe she'll forget about the message? Who knows? Oh my god, go away, Arturo. Helsinki, kill him right now. Use it, kill him. Kill him! Kill him! <laughs> please kill him. Just end his life, please. <laughs> Fucking go ahead. He's not gonna do it, but I want him to.
Do it hard then. <sighs> Can someone else kill him? I just want him dead. <laughs> Okay, see, I knew he was going to try to find a, a different way, so I'm glad that he did. Delete it! Yes! Yes! Oh my god. That was very convenient for the professor, but I'm not, I'm not complaining. He's so good! Oh my god! And the thing is, is like he actually likes her too, so it's just like, oh my god. He's amazing. Oh, is she putting something to No, stop, stop, stop. I thought she was like putting it together that he was the person. gonna be half and half maybe Arturo didn't go with them to be locked in the basement. Ugh, that would be the day. I don't believe that the professor had, you know, cleaned that place up top to bottom before they started this. He has a nice singing voice. <laughs> this, this, okay. I'm getting nervous. There's only like f four or five minutes left. I'm so nervous. Oh God. He had to have cleaned all that stuff up, right? I mean, come on. Oh no, he didn't. Oh my god, his fingerprints are going to be everywhere. And so is everyone else's. How did he not think of this? Unless he like planted somebody else's fingerprints on this stuff. Uh oh. The schematics for everything. How did he not think to get all this out? God. What? What? Could you imagine if this like wasn't successful and they just like ended it like that and there was only one season of it and they like canceled it or something? That was like a movie. Honestly, it was like the first movie out of like a saga or something. Oh my god. All right I thought there was gonna be something else that happened, but Not every episode has to be some big climactic like battle or something. They had that last episode But this is a perfect ending for a continuation of the story Which I'm very excited about because I know there I think they have five seasons now So I just finished the first one thoughts as a whole on the season Loved the acting, loved the story, loved most of the plot lines. There was a couple things where I just was just kind of like not into, mainly Arturo. <laughs> I'm upset that he made it through alive in this first season and I'm gonna have to deal with him in the second season too, but the guy who is working with Raquel's fate, he could potentially be alive and then even though like the professor you know, got rid of the note, got rid of the voice message, the grandmother doesn't remember anything. Um, he could potentially have trouble with that guy coming to and just remembering everything and then, you know, messing it up. A big thing now is what the hell is going to happen now that they have literally the all the plans for everything, plus all the DNA on everything. That must have been planted there, right? I mean, 
the professor has had everything planned out, everything ready, and somehow he just forgot about that whole thing and it didn't think that maybe somebody would find it. Like, that doesn't seem plausible, I don't know. So that's making me think, what if it's all like a setup there? And what if the schedules and the planning is all wrong? Like they have like some correct information, but then he like purposefully put in incorrect information. I don't know. They know that they're trying to build a tunnel to escape. They know about who the hostages are. They know there's eight um, people who are running this operation. And what's gonna happen with the people that are locked down in the basement? What about the people that stayed up top? Because they, the teacher, Ariadna and Arturo are all three people who kind of know better and Ariadna stopped three of her students, I think, from going to the other side of freedom so they all could possibly revolt. I really, really enjoyed this season. The show is really good. Um, like I said in past episodes, this and Elite are two of my favorite shows to watch, like, ever. Also, How to Get Away with Murder, but that kind of goes without saying. I've been watching that forever now. And I'm just really excited to start the second season now and just see what happens. I didn't expect them to still be in that place, the Royal Mint. I thought that they were going to eventually make it out by the first season, and then, like, the next season might be, like, another heist or something like that. So I'm not sure how long and how many seasons they're going to be in that royal mint. I mean, there's only so much you can really do with it, I think, right? I guess we're gonna have to see. Um, but yeah, let me know what you thought about the first season, this final episode. Try not to spoil anything for me for the later seasons. Um, who's, to tell me, on, in at least in the first season, who is your favorite character? Because I like to know that. My favorite character is definitely Nairobi. I like her a lot. Um, and I also like Tokyo, she's pretty badass. I like pretty much most of them. Denver, obviously I like him with the woman that he's with and I can't remember her name, but I really like them together. I hope that still becomes a thing. Yeah, let me know what you thought about this first season and um, I'm probably gonna take a little bit of a break for this um, until the second season just because it's been taking me a while to get episodes out of everything at once, so I'm thinking what I'm gonna do is at least finish up the season of Elite that I have going on right now, do a couple more episodes of How to Get Away with Murder, a couple more episodes of 13 Reasons Why. Once I'm done with the season two of Elite, I'll start this back up, I think. I think that's I think that's what I'm thinking. I might I might do something different, I'm not sure. Um, but that's that's my plan for now. So I will be coming back to this. I will be watching all of the seasons, so Keep an eye out for those. Subscribe if you haven't already. I, I watch shows like this all the time. I put out reviews occasionally of, of certain shows and stuff like this, which I'm probably going to be doing with these. I will see you on all my other episodes and when season two of Money Heist starts back up. Bye.